What's up guys, in this video I just want to show you how I fixed the issue I was having with my laptop not being able to control the display brightness if I'm using the NVIDIA GPU as the default. My laptop and my main computer in general is a Lenovo Legion 5 with a Ryzen 4800H and a GTX 1660 Ti. It has AMD graphics built in but I can't use the hybrid mode because I haven't been able to get NVIDIA Optimus to work, but that's a problem for later me. This particular issue with the display brightness has been happening to me on Debian 11 and Debian testing. It worked just fine on Fedora when I briefly tested it about a month ago, and the way that I fixed it here on Debian is by adding a new kernel parameter into the bootloader. It's a weird one too, it's nvidia.nvreg underscore registry dwords equals enable brightness control equals one. It sounds like something you would set in like an actual registry or like an xconfig, but it works as a kernel parameter and it fixed the issue, so. If you're new to editing Grub, there are a couple ways you can do it. You can edit a file located at slash etsy slash default slash grub, but if you do it that way, you have to run another tool called update grub, which generates the files located in slash boot. I like to use a tool called grub customizer because it's easy to use and it handles all of the scripty stuff behind the scenes. If you use something besides Grub for your bootloader, the kernel parameter is still good, but you'll need to add it however your bootloader likes. I've heard that systemd boot is better than Grub 2, but Grub is what Debian uses, and I figure if it's not broke, don't fix it. Adding a kernel parameter to your bootloader configuration isn't all that uncommon, though it does seem a little bit strange that I needed to add this one just to enable display brightness, but whatever. That's all I have for this short little video. I've been wanting to focus a bit more on Linux how-to and help topics since there have been a lot more new users in the Linux community lately. I hope that you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it for you. I appreciate all your support and thanks for watching.